John Miller would have been 29 years old at the time of Tinsley's murder. Tonight, we are learning more about him. News Channel 15's Kai Torque joins us live in the newsroom. Kai Torque, you talk with people who knew him. What did they have to say about Miller? Tara, they all described him as a loner. We talked to several co-workers and neighbors, some who knew him decades ago and some that know him now, and they all paint the same exact picture. Who is John Miller, the man arrested for the rape and murder of April Tinsley? Neighbors at his Grable Trailer Home Park say he's lived in this trailer for more than 30 years. They describe the 59-year-old man as someone who kept to himself and never said hi to anyone. He always appeared angry. He'd always have a kind of like a mean look on his face. He would use swear words a lot when he would get mad. One neighbor even remembers him throwing his lawnmower. There was only one thing they'd see Miller do outside of his trailer. He would walk up and down the street, go to the softball diamonds, and sit and watch the kids play. Miller also went to work. In the 1980s and 90s, he worked for a fiberglass factory in Grable called Eagle Pitcher Plastics, now known as R3 Composites. His co-workers said he didn't have any friends there, had poor hygiene, and had a temper. He got fired from the factory after punching and breaking the time clock. In recent years, Miller worked for the Walmart in Kendallville, where he was known as John John. He worked the overnight shift in the electronics department. We didn't know anything about him. Uh, I, I sure didn't. But they knew what they saw, the hunched walk, the speech impediment, the anger. Um, I've heard him uh, beating on equipment and because it wasn't walking right. But whether at the factory, the Walmart, or his neighborhood, no one had any idea that he'd be arrested for the murder of eight-year-old April Tinsley. It was very shocking. I I'm kind of have that sick feeling. Like, there's butterflies in my stomach. I, I, I don't know what to think. I, I would have never known. Co-worker says that she can't wrap her mind around the fact that Miller's behavior never changed, even after he supposedly killed young Tinsley. And one other thing that we learned about him is that he does have a brother. In the newsroom, Kai Torque, News Channel 15.